guys, to the Spurgeon Piper. This is Wilson with you. So this video was meant to go out last week, but one of my kiddos accidentally dropped or knocked over water onto my laptop, destroying it. And some of you already knew this because I made a quick uh, post on the community channel and then on Facebook as well. So anyhow, uh, so I lost my laptop, had to get a new one. I even think it messed up my microphone a bit. So if it sounds a little off, staticky, apologies. I'll probably have to get a new one as well. Uh, but I wanted to make this video because, number one, I just passed 6,000 subscribers. It was last week, or, yeah, it was last week. And secondly, I haven't done a giveaway in a, quite a while. Um, back in March, I did the Tobacco Madness March giveaway. And since then, I, I don't know when's the last time I've done a, a giveaway for subscribers. I think, it was, I think I've only done it once, like with 1,000, possibly. So, with all that said, I... I'm grateful for the community. I'm grateful for your support and those of you who subscribe. Much appreciated. And I love the YTPC community. Uh, I'm grateful for Twitter and Facebook and Instagram and, and the folks, pipe, especially pipe smokers, I meet through, through those avenues. But I love more than anything the YTPC when it comes to those other avenues. So thank you for what you do. And if you make videos, thank you as well. I, I follow a lot of you and I'm grateful for you. And... Uh, the camaraderie we can have online. It's not as perfect as being in person, but it's better than a lot of what we have, isn't it? All right, so with that said, uh, on the giveaway, it's during this time of year where we have all of our lists come out of the top five, top 10, top number one blends we tried for 2022 or whatever year it is in the past. Uh, so I'm gonna take that idea, but flip it over for this giveaway, and I want you to tell me the top two worst blends you tried this year. So, some clarification. Number one, when I say top worst, they may be a okay blend, you may enjoy it a bit, but it's just the worst of everything else you tried. And then number two, it is blends that you tried for the first time this year, and they may be re-releases, or they may be uh, new releases, or they may be blends that have been out for a long time, but you just now tried this year, okay? So for the first time, if you tried Orlet Golden Slice, that's a candidate. Uh, so those are the blends, the categories you can choose from. And so what I am expecting is, number one, for the first way to enter, is to subscribe, and then to leave a comment below on those two blends. All right, uh, below this video, leave a comment just saying, these two blends and uh, why what I don't like about them so that's the first way to enter the second way to enter is doing a video response and uh, a lot of you do this already but if you're not sure what I'm talking about that's simply loading up a video you know recording a video loading it up on your YouTube channel and tagging me in it and please do this because I won't know otherwise so you can put at Spurgeon Piper in the description or in the Dropbox and it will tag my channel and let me know you made a video. Um, and you, you're more than welcome to put a comment below on this video as well saying, hey, I just made a video too, and I'll, I'll be sure to check it out. So I'm going to let this run for about two weeks, okay? Um, and you can look below for the official date. I don't know what the date is, but I'll put it below in the Dropbox, and you can find it there. So with all that said, uh, let me get to the winnings, so what, what I'm giving away. And it pertains to everything that's come out this year or things I've tried this year. Uh, so first off, one of Cornell and Dill's first small batch releases of this year, it may not be the first, but it's one of the first, is Small Batch Folklore. Um, and this is just in a, this is a hodgepodge of so many different types of blends. I'd have reviewed it, you can check it out. Cigar Leaf, Virginia, I think Latakia, Oriental, everything is in this. So I'm going to give you some of this. Uh, I'm going to be taking out a good chunk of this, like two ounces or so, uh, because it comes in cake form, and that will go into the winnings. Uh, Scarecrow Warped, this was a re-release, and uh, this was... This was a blend that I have reviewed. You can find that just recently, but I think I'm even more higher on it, or my rating is higher on it. I'm near complete of my other blend, uh, or my other tin. In fact, just to show you, this is my other open tin, and uh, I got that that much left. 
I'll, I'll smoke it for sure by the end of November, I imagine. I'm really enjoying it. So I'm going to be giving away one of these. Maybe you weren't able to get some. I know some of you weren't, and I will be giving some away. Uh, you'll enjoy it. Saint Espresso Warped. Uh, this is an interesting blend by Warped Cigars as well, and Cordell and Deal. It has a cigar Cavendish leaf in it with a an espresso coffee topping. I have reviewed it as well. Uh, people who don't like aromatics are really high on this blend, so you can take that for what you will. Um, I'll be giving this away. I know a lot of Cornell and Dill here, but they released a lot that I tried. Uh, and then their Carolina Red Flake. I bought so much of this, and I'm glad I bought so much of this. This is another one where I think my opinion has now increased than when I originally reviewed it. And you can find that review as well. Um, but I finished out the tin of this in, in no time. Um, I just kept smoking this alone out and setting everything else aside. So I'm giving away some of this. Uh, all right, so getting away from Cornell and Dill. Uh, Emerson Southern Forged, uh, they are a, a newer company. Uh, the guys reached out to me on Instagram. And I've reviewed two of their blends, one on this channel and then one on my Instagram channel, which you can go check out my Instagram channel to check that out. But it's Redwick, which is a fantastic uh, Virginia-based blend. You will get this whole jar, all right? So um, I'm really looking forward to some of you all getting your hands on this because I think it's a blend. It's a company for you to get acquainted with, and uh, you'll like this blend. Um, another one is Presbyterian Reformation, another aromatic blend that I reviewed this year uh, that came out, what now, two months ago. And again, one of those great aromatic blends that strikes the balance of you're getting the aromas of more of a chocolate note of this, but also it depends on the foundation of quality leaf. So I like this blend. I think you will too if you haven't tried it. And then finally, uh, finally, this was definitely a treat for this year. I don't know how many of you got your hands on it, but John David Cole at the Country Squire and the good folks there, everyone else who supports them, they had some remaining McClellan leaf that they blended into the blend called Whale Song. And it's gone. I mean, that was it. It's not coming back as far as I'm concerned. Maybe they will. Uh, but as far as I'm aware, they're not getting any more. Or they're gonna, not going to have any more because they're out of their McClellan stock uh, leaf stock so anyhow i'm going to be giving you some of this blend here cornell and dill in fact cornell and dill sorry country scar well song so this is a essentially a mcclellan blend it's a virginia parique blend i did review it as well so you will be receiving this bag here and i'm going to let you know it is opened but it's all it's all good um it was just taped so i will retape it and you will receive that all right so this is what I'm giving away, and to enter the giveaway, follow the directions I told, and I will pick two winners for comments and one winner for the video, all right? So two winners for comments, one winner for video. The video winner will receive more of the winnings. Um, exactly what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, the just, I, I know video requires a lot more work, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to give the winner of the video five of the blends, and the, I'll have two remaining blends for uh, the comments, so um, let me encourage you to put the work into the videos, because that's usually more enjoyable, but anyhow, I hope you participate. Guys, thank you again for the support, and we will talk to you very soon.